Daniel, I see there's a magic box this morning. There is, and it's yeah. down here. Hi. <laughs> Should we open it? Let's open it, see All what's right. in it. So this magic box helps huh. us tell stories. Oh, and, some hats. Uh, oh, cool. yeah, some hats. I like yeah. these. I, like so I got some flowers. Oh, there's more. Yeah, there's, there's more. more. There's oh, look at Sparks these. Hats. Amazing. I wonder why there's a bunch of hats in here this morning. Uh, we need hats. No, actually, oh, you know what? It reminds me of this story. Remember that story we were reading earlier this week? Oh, yeah, we were just yeah. looking at it yesterday. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My memory's going. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. It's a story about a town of people who were looking for luck yep. everywhere. They went looking for luck under the benches, under their cars, and they couldn't find any. Mm -hmm. And so what they did was they just kind of gave up. They said, we can't find any luck, so we're going to give up. And they stopped building their buildings and fixing their sidewalks and growing their gardens. It was kind, mm -hmm. of, a, a, kind of a downer thing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Even though they might have had hats that looked like this one. Right, right. Still, they had no luck. Well, so you know what happened next is that this woman came to town wearing a beautiful hat. Probably, you know, something like this one, maybe. Um, and what she told them was that there's actually something better than luck. What? What's better than luck? Yeah, well, they asked the same question. What on earth could be better than luck? But they figured they had nothing to lose, so they better listen to her. And so what she said is that tomorrow, in the town square, like hundreds and hundreds of butterflies, like on this stall, are going to land in the town square. And what you should do then is throw all of your hats on top of them so that you will have hope. Throw your hats? You'll have your butterflies so of throw hope. Throw these hats? Yeah, let's throw try. Them, throw yeah. the hats. Okay, oh. throw the hats. Oh, okay. Onto We're the catching ground all like the that, butterflies. Right? Yeah. So they caught Just the like butterflies? That. Yes, the butterflies were under the hats. They had caught, caught them. down on the ground. we got to catch the butterflies. And they were so excited because they said, finally, now we have hope. This is so great. You're kidding. Yeah. <laughs> then what happened? Well, see, then the problem was it started raining. Oh. And... This they didn't have any umbrellas, apparently, and so they had, to go, they had to go get all of their hats yeah. and put them on their heads to protect them from the rain. Come up here and put this one and on. Yeah, stand here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so, Sit in the it's front row raining. is what happens. We're going to make, yep. uh, we'll make her do that now. <laughs> you don't want one of these? Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> here. So, hey, hold that. So... Okay. They put the hats on to protect themselves from the rain, but the problem was then all of the butterflies that had landed in the town square just flew away and all the butterflies of hope were gone. Ugh. And so then they were sad again. They said, not only do we not have luck anymore, but now we don't have hope either. That is sad. Yeah. But as most stories go, there was a turn. Yes. And the woman said, but look under your hats. And the people kind of looked at her. Hey, What's under your hat? Look under your hat. Anything under your hat? She said, they, they kind of looked and she was said, there's a little trace of hope in there that the butterflies left. Oh, like the powder the butterflies leave when they yeah, land on things? I don't know if, the ah. if they leave powder, but okay. Yeah, and, from their wings. And so they felt like they could take the hope with them and go back to work and fix their buildings and fix the sidewalks and they weeded their gardens and they grew their gardens and... Things nice. were good again. Well, and all they had to do was look under their hats. Yeah. I mean, that's where they were. They were a source of hope, the people, right? Is that what the story's about? Yeah, that's a piece of it. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it's a story about finding hope when things are difficult, hmm. right? Their town was in a pretty difficult situation. And so our kids in their classes this morning are going to be looking at this story and other stories of finding hope in difficult times. Hmm. And so we hope that you'll talk some more about that, and we're going to talk more about that in the service as and well. And I'm going to wear this hat for the and rest of the And you're going to wear this hat. Okay, okay. Thank you for your help. <laughs> so now let's sing the children and their teachers to their classes with Go Now in Peace. The words are inside the back cover of your hymnals. <laughs> 